Initially, I was uh, taken aback by the fact that he continues to assure that there has that due process has been followed. This wasn't the case uh, for the first six months. Matt was uh, kept in prolonged solitary confinement, um, didn't have the right access to medical care and psychiatric care. He was being medicated, but that does not con constitute care. Um, he did not have access to legal counsel in spite of explicitly asking for it during interrogation process, which he described as very tough. Um, and he had very, very limited access to consular visits and consular support. Um, and this is in direct violation of all international legal standards um, and of human rights. So I find that no number of hearings or judges assessing a case um, can make up for this violation of due process. However, as his uh, declaration progressed, um, I, I grew more hopeful and somewhat more grateful um, to the UAE leaders. I hope that they are indeed considering um, Matt's and my plea, Matt's family and my plea for for um, for his liberation, for clemency, uh, and I hope they find it in their hearts um, that he is a, a good man, uh, a man that means no harm and has never meant any harm to the UAE, and a man who's loved and needed by his family and naturally by me. Um, I, I remain hopeful. I, however, will not rest until I have him at home safely with me.